At Def Expo 2014, Tata Motors showcased two new combat vehicles. The first one is the Kestrel, a wheeled armored amphibious platform providing mobility to frontline soldiers carrying them into the battle zone with critical armor protection backed with adequate fire support. The other new project is the LAMV, or Light Armored High Mobility Vehicle. It is a recon vehicle moving ahead of the armored columns. Tata Motors Defense, through the Kestrel and the LAMV, provides the Indian Armored Forces with world-class indigenously developed frontline protected mobility. Hello, what can you tell us about this new turret? What we see here is the Kongsberg uh, remote uh, turret on the Tata vehicle. Uh, we have a remote 30mm uh, turret in the bottom and on top of that we have a Kongsberg Protector remote uh, weapon station. Uh, both systems are operated remotely from a control panel looking like this. You have the fire control uh, unit here, you have the, remote, you have the uh, control grip here for operating the system. Um, the main weapon, the 30mm cannon, is, um, is uh, fully stabilized. It has uh, linkless ammunition feet. You can uh, feed from both the uh, right and left side. And uh, the linkless ammunition system gives you the ability to reload the system at any time. And the reload can be done from under armor and you can also reload the system uh, from the outside. If you take a closer look, I can uh, show you a little bit how the uh, remote weapon station on top is operated. In this particular configuration, we have a day camera and also a laser range finder. And this configuration also has one javelin missile on the side, which is also launched from the same uh, fire control unit. Kongsberg is the world leading uh, supplier of remote weapon stations. We have sold more than 17,000 systems throughout the world. And uh, this is our first time uh, exhibiting in uh, India. So we are very pleased to be together with Tata Motors on their new amphibious vehicle. So looking forward to see what, uh, what we might uh, get in India. Okay, okay. gentlemen, the Kestrel is an eight by eight wheeled armored amphibious vehicle. This is a joint project development with the VRD, DRDO and Tata Motors. This is the first of its kind indigenous vehicle developed in India and uh, we have developed this vehicle from concept to design to about first prototype, what you are seeing here in about record 17 months of time. And uh, the whole vehicle is like upgradable, scalable and modular. We have already worked out about six platforms on the same vehicle like the ambulance, uh, mortar carrier, the missile carrier, CNBC vehicles, the Ricky vehicle and similarly the whole vehicle has uh, upgradable armoring so it can go from Stanak 1 to Stanak 4 uh, in just short period of time. At the same time this has an integrated power pack so which can be taken out completely for the overhauling and servicing in about half an hour time. It has 8x8 independent suspension. The Electrical and electronic what we are having is an open architecture type and also the turret whatever you see the firepower right now we are using it from the Kongsberg is also the modular so you can use a two man turret we can use a remote control weapon station and it is modular design. What you see behind us is a LAMV that is light armored multi-purpose vehicle again this is a light type of combat vehicle and uh, I have with me uh, Mr. Agarwal who will talk little bit more about this vehicle uh, who is also the chief engineer of this program light armored multi-purpose vehicle is designed in-house with a power pack designed by Tata Motors independent suspension the, this vehicle was having a stiff target of the weight the GVW so we had to work upon aluminium design of axles the springs and all have to be within the optimized weight it's a composite pod which is there armored hull which is at the bottom and well integrated to give an optimum design the optimum weight to give the end requirement of the defense 